Hello everyone and welcome back to these pivot videos. Today I actually have a an interesting article and it's a video that goes along with it so that'll help with your listening comprehension. Uh, so if you please pause this video right here, read the article and listen to the fast video. Uh, please do that right now and then I will give you my opinion. So as you can see, it is about Star Wars, or Star Wars Day, actually, which is today, March, or uh, May the 4th. And I've actually kind of looked online, and I'm not too sure how they came up with May the 4th to be Star Wars Day. But I will say that I watched all four, or uh, not four, all six of the, the original Star Wars movies, the first three back in the 1980s, and then the the past three in the uh, in the last decade. I like them. Do I play all the video games and all that stuff now? Of course not. Although I will say that I do watch a TV show called The Big Bang Theory. I know probably it's really popular all throughout the world. And the previous episode, don't want any spoilers, but the previous episode was about um, May 4th, Star Wars Day, and they would joke, it's May the 4th be with you, and I didn't even realize what they were talking about until I saw this article come, that I came across with um, this morning, and I thought, oh, but this is a real thing, this is, this is Star Wars Day, okay. So, I will find out exactly why it, they chose the 4th. Maybe it's because maybe the 4th be with you. Maybe that's why they came up with that. I don't know. But, I think next week I will talk about the Big Bang Theory. Just because I'm not sure if I've described that in any of my previous videos. But I think it's a hilarious TV show. So, that'll be for next week. So, I hope you enjoyed this little pop culture article and if you have any questions about it or about English please let me or the team at Pivot know. Thank you very much.